Hello students, welcome back. In this part, we will discuss about the endomembrane system that includes the organelles like endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi bodies, vacuoles and lysosomes. And why they are present in the endomembrane system, why only these organelles are included in the endomembrane system, you will get to know at the end of this part. So, let's start. The endomembrane system. Endomembrane system includes endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi bodies, lysosomes and vacuoles. The other organelles like mitochondria and plastids uh, and peroxisomes also, all of these organelles, the functions of all of these organelles are not coordinated with these organelles, with the endomembrane system in any way. So, uh, mitochondria, plastids, the peroxisome, these are not included in the endomembrane system. So, under the endomembrane system, first we will discuss about the endoplasmic reticulum. Endoplasmic reticulum is nothing but a network or reticulum of tiny tubular structures that are scattered in the cytoplasm. So this is the real picture showing the endoplasmic reticulum here. This endo, uh, endoplasmic reticulum it is present in almost all eukaryotic cells. But there are exceptions also. So endoplasmic reticulum, it is not present in ova, embryonic cells and mammalian RBCs. So these all, they lack ER. The prokaryotes, they also lack e, uh, endoplasmic reticulum. But in rapidly dividing cells, the endoplasmic reticulum, it is poorly developed. 